Hello, this is Kerry with 2DigitalGypsies.com, and if you're interested in going on a safari in Kenya, let me highly recommend Enidura Big Step Safaris as your first choice. Enidura Safaris is run by friends of ours, the husband and wife team of David Nguito and Mary Purcell. David is Maasai and Mary is Australian. Mary handles the bookings and logistics and David drives the safari vehicle and is the guide. David can speak Ma, the language of the Maasai people, Swahili and English, and is able to talk to just about any person you would come across on a safari. The first leg of her safari took us near Mount Kenya and we stayed at the Sweetwaters Tented Camp on the Old Pajeta Conservancy. During our two-day stay there, we visited the chimpanzee sanctuary and did five game drives viewing the local wildlife. David proved to be a knowledgeable guide, able not only to find many great viewing opportunities, but also to educate us about the wildlife, the terrain, and life in Kenya. The second leg of our safari took us to Lake Navasha, where we took a boat tour on the lake and stayed at the Lake Navasha Sopa Resort on the south end of the lake. The last leg of our safari was spent in the Masai Mara National Reserve. It was amazing. I'm glad Mary and David saved the best for last. When we entered the Mara, we did a game drive that ended up at the Mara Serena Safari Lodge. The views of the Mara from the lodge property were breathtaking. The next day we took a box lunch from the Mara Serena Lodge and spent the whole day on another game drive. We ended up at the Ashnell Resort located on the Mara River. Each day we did game drives early morning and late afternoon. Mary surprised us the second to last evening at the Ashnell by joining us for dinner, when at the time we thought she was still in Nairobi. On the final day of our safari we had sundowners in the Mara, which involved having cocktails and snacks while watching the sunset from a hill. On our way back to Ashnell we noticed a huge campfire burning and Mary said it was probably researchers. We drove over to check it out and guess what, another surprise from Mary and David. This time it was a bush dinner complete with waiters, cooks, a linen covered table and rangers to guard against the animals. Mother Nature also had a surprise for us and dumped wind and rain on us all through an excellent dinner. As soon as dinner was over the rain quit but then a number of Maasai jumped out of the bushes and began a performance of their own. The background music you hear on this video is from the Maasai performers. Since Mary and David are friends of ours, they surprise us with the bush dinner. But if you decide to go on safari, we suggest you ask that a bush dinner get added in to your itinerary. So if you want a personal touch when planning a safari, Barbara and I highly recommend Enidura as your safari choice. Our arrangements all came off without a hitch, and David was wonderful at getting us around and finding amazing wildlife viewings that made for an unforgettable experience. If you'd like to contact Mary or David at N.A. Dura Safaris, please click the link at the end of this video or the link in the video description. If you like this video, please click the thumbs up on this video page, and if you'd like to see more of our videos, please visit our YouTube channel, Two Digital Gypsies. <laughs> Don't you move on your